Well, here sits the great yellow bee spotted man in a nice big bath of diesel fuel. I uh, poured almost a full gallon through it, and things seem to be pretty free. Um, I don't know if you can hear that, but the bearings, they're not rumbling at all. But it does seem like it makes, let's see if I can get it to do it again. It's making kind of a strange noise, like one of the pork chops is rubbing, rubbing against the case. Um, I wouldn't think that that's normal. And I'm wondering if the crankshaft may have spread a little bit, whether it worked its way free from the rest, from the crank pin. Um, a fair bit of debris did come out of it. Here's um, one of the, the bigger chunks. Most of the other stuff was pretty small. Uh, but that's kind of what I'm looking at. So, while well, there's... Oh, Eric did it. It's going to go backwards. I can't get it to do it again. I don't know. Do you guys think that that sounds okay? Go backwards again a little bit. Um, and I'm going to look down on the side. I don't to get enough illumination in. Uh, there's no more chunks down in there. Um, nothing come out for a while. So like I said, the whole gallon of diesel fuel has been poured through the bearings in the crankcase here. Um, so I'll do a little cleanup tomorrow. And uh, depending upon what the verdict is, um, I may start just slapping her back together. So seems to seems to roll pretty well. Um, do my best to measure the uh, any of the crank characteristics that I can. Um, so, there it is. Looks um, promising.